in news on TLDR with Andrea. Eli Lilly just announced that it would reduce the prices of its most commonly used insulin by 70%, capping it at $35 per month, which is going to help a lot of people. The average price of insulin for a lot of Americans has been anywhere between $60 and $150 per month. This is a big deal since 37 million people have diabetes, and what's even crazier is another 96 million people have prediabetes. Prediabetes is when people have high blood sugar levels, but not quite type 2. If you fall into this category, you could reverse the effects with the right diet and exercise, so keep that in mind at your next physical. So we are talking about almost a third of the population here that will be affected by this price change. And what's crazy is that insulin is relatively inexpensive to manufacture, but its cost has been a problem for many Americans. 16.5% of people in the US have actually gone to rationing it out. We're talking about important meds here, not saving the next episode of a binge-worthy TV show for tomorrow night. So that was my basic breakdown, but get the full scoop from our partners on the News on app. I'm Andrea Fetchko, and I'll see you guys later.